welcome to your city photo booth. We want to unveil to you our brand new product and we want to show you how easy it is to set up. So Mike and I are here going to set this up. It can be set up by one person very easily, but for the sake of the matter, we're just going to show you with both of us setting it, setting it up. And uh, it's our new five by five enclosure. We also have a six by six one, but we're going to show you the five by five. Everything literally fits into this bag. And then the, the actual like surrounding is in this bag right here. So we're just going to dump this all out. Makes a little bit of noise. And it's all lettered and numbered exactly how it goes. So we're just going to literally pop it all together. And then we find the best thing to do is we've set this up a couple times now. Is I have letter A and P. So we're just going to like start doing our letter in the alphabet. A lot of corners and they start like there's your C D, E F, and then we got A B. So it's pretty easy once you get them put in the proper order that they need to go. Because then you can just grab and go. So okay. with the corners you just connect the uh, the letter to the other corresponding letter, letter like M and M, L and L, and so forth. Like I was saying, it literally will just go together like this. So you'll see O and O, and it snaps into place. Just that easy. I have P and D. Okay. Now we found D.
Jay. Like that. This okay. goes. No, I think you got that. I got K. No, very good there. up to show you. And the only thing you need to screw in, there's two screws on the bottom of this and there's a hex wrench that I put in my pocket before that we use to connect this. And all it does is Next, this way, if you were doing this with one person, this part would be laying on the ground. But right now, since there's two of us, we'll just leave it like this. And you saw before that I didn't have F and F lined up. And I did that on purpose because I just wanted to show you guys that literally you could just change it, like unsnap it, and then it goes back into place. Now we put the one side on. We need the other brace on the other side, and it connects the same exact way. So there's just these two braces that make it tight. I unscrew mine, wait for them to screw his in. Now like I said, the other one we just hand did hand tight. I mean it really didn't do much when I use the when I use the Allen wrench to make it tight anymore. So we're just gonna leave it like that because I want to show you that it literally it can only just be hand tightened. Now that we have these two together, the whole structure is together, and we can literally what we're going to do is, since we're both here putting it on, we're just going to take the, we already put the uh, enclosure out of the bag. So the enclosure just comes in this bag. And Mike has it, so we're just going to throw it on. And again, this is available in 5x5 five five and 6x6. Six six. The depth of it is just under 5 feet. So when you put your booth back and whatnot, it'll end up being five feet total, but it's about four feet, six and six, seven inches on the long wise, like width wise, it is exactly five feet. Now you can see with both of us here doing this, we're just gonna stretch this on and we're gonna put it all on, on the one side first to make sure everything's good. And we can easily tell if it needs to be moved over like this one does just a little bit, because. There's more black on my side and the front. And um, if you were doing this by yourself, you would literally go one side to the other and pull. And that's why we did it. So the zipper is only on one side. We tried on the top and the bottom and that, and it was a lot of zipper, especially going around the corners. So this was the way we felt like that. But you can see once we get it, how easy it is to go around. And now that this is like this, we're just gonna flip it up like this. And it's not heavy, so one person can do that by themselves too. We can take a look at it real quick. We can still adjust it if we need to. So Mike is gonna pull his side a little bit to make it straight. And you could do this right in the beginning too. We just didn't, we're just throwing it on really fast. You so it's super easy to adjust. And then after that, we're just gonna pick it up and move it towards Mike so we can flip it around and show you and you can see that. We're not pretty much being that gentle with it. And this is the enclosure. And we're going to pull it. And you can easily see that one person can do this a zipper at a time. We can pull it to make it a little more tighter. So you can see, like we just threw it together and didn't even really try that much. And literally, there's hardly any bends or anything in here at all. And that was only, took us about 10 minutes total to set up. When you're in it and stuff, like if somebody knocks into it, I mean, it's gonna move a little bit, but it's still pretty sturdy. It's not going anywhere. Now with our booths, if you want to see how a booth looks in it, I'm going to grab the mini real quick. I'm 
So say for instance we throw the mini in here. So you literally could have a nice pattern of people walking in like this taking their photo whatnot, and there's plenty of room going out this way to get in and out. There's like a good foot, foot and a half of space. If you add it six feet, I mean, you could uh, obviously have more space in it and whatnot, but this is literally with, uh, with five feet. And then we're gonna grab the tower booth real quick so you can have a, an idea about that as well. So the tower booth looks really good here too, it's the same, you know, your prints are coming out to one side, so it's not, it's only a little bit wider, but there's still like full body length of me to get on the side on both sides. So you can see that somebody can come in, you can easily have a flow of people coming in and out. And um, literally, like you can have people all go in one side and come out the other side and literally you're all set. We have this, we can customize this. Let's pick this up real quick. Now that you saw that. So you can see that this literally takes about 10 minutes to set up. You can customize inside. It doesn't have to be a green screen. It could be anything that you want. We can put your logos all around. I'm going to um, actually take the camera and go around the whole booth. You can see my company in Buffalo here is called Toy Brothers Entertainment. And our logos are in the bottom corners over here. So when you walk in, you can see it. The green screen set. Um, we used this at my brother's wedding a couple weeks ago for the first time. Went over really, really well. I'll throw in. I'll show you what the gifs look like when, um, when I right after this video and I'll show you what the photo output it is from the tower booth and then on the outside of the booth you can do the same thing you can do anything that you want we just have this black damask going on and our logo is on the sides and the back and it just makes for a really simple elegant setup and if set up to 10 minutes you guys know that if you ever use anything like this before takedown is about five minutes I mean and we took our time and that was 10 minutes with two people so if you're doing it by yourself you're looking at no more than 20 minutes Super easy. I didn't even help him zipper it up. I would just pull the side because we didn't pull it all together. And you can see that there's really no play. It's super tight in the corners and whatnot, and it'll be perfect for a green screen setup. Again, this is five feet. We have a six feet option, and we'll customize it to be whatever you want it to be.